Hi pals and welcome back to my World of Tanks channel. I'm Antonov2 and today I'm bringing you one of the remnants from the 8.8 test server. This is a game I played there in my T-34-3 which I was testing out a lot and this is an amazing vehicle because it's got that amazing alpha damage with this 122mm gun on a tier 8 medium tank that it can out alpha damage uh, other tier 8 heavy tanks actually. So that is really amazing and there's an enemy T-34 pushing up quite keenly so I'll go for a side and look at that we ammo racked him and took 1060 uh, HP of him oh that was <laughs> but the ammo rack on these Chinese medium tanks is extremely weak but <laughs> one shot and 1060 damage oh it's amazing so there's an object 416, the new Russian tier 8 medium tank, and we got a nice damaging hit into him. Quite a lot of damage there. He's got no armor whatsoever, and his alpha damage is kind of low. That's why I feel very nice. Uh, it's very nice trading shots with him. So I easily punch through the frontal armor of that VK. There, he hasn't got all that great armor, but I've only got 175 millimeters of pen. So that's pretty good. I'm on very low HP now because somebody got a very high damaging shot into me. I get a nice shot through the side armor of Object 416. It wouldn't surprise me if my gun might even outmatch that. Like, outmatching is a the caliber uh, of the gun firing at the armor is triple the amount of armor. Because then the shot will penetrate no matter how well the armor is angled, so even if it's auto bounce. So that super purging there is quite a problem for me because he mean like he being there means that I can't go around and take out that object phone at 16. If I was lucky I could one shot him. Now I think that T34-3 up there got a shot into my turret but my turret is 190mm at the front and angled very very well so he obviously bounced. And that super purging is taking a hit, not all that much damage though. So I'm trying to go for Indian Panzer, can't get him, so I hope that that Super Persian isn't firing gold at me, because this is a test server after all, but you know, if he was firing gold he would have probably penned my 90mm full armor, but with a standard gun that will be very tricky for him. So the Indian Panzer's got his rear to us, what's he doing that for? Hmm, interesting. <laughs> well, I don't mind, you know. Keep on, keep on heading into battle with your rear first. It's fine with me. We could finish him off with an a bit above damage roll, but obviously, of course, how could it else be? We roll really, really low when it matters, so we don't get the kill. But that, that, that armor rack was enough for one game, really. <laughs> so. We've got this game in the bag now, the score is 94, and it looks like my allies on the left flank could do with some support. So what I'm going to try to do here is come from the rear and take out that T-34-3. I didn't realise that there's still that T-34-3 behind me in the village, if you look here, uh, there, there's the T-34-3. I didn't realise that he's still there, but... Uh, there's a Yak Tiger, no, it's a, yeah, a Yak Tiger 88, and another T34-3 there to deal with him, so they should manage fine. And now we're still the IS-6 and the T. No, I think the T34-3 on this flank was taken out by the A44 and the T34-3. So there's only this IS-6 left, and I'm kind of getting a bit carried away now. And you know what happens if I get carried away? Yeah, that's right. I get killed. <laughs> yeah, that was a bit stupid of me poking my... Oh, it wasn't a bit stupid, it was just very stupid of me poking my nose around there with the IS-6 reloaded. And I tried to pull back, but it was too late. And I just I just, just wasn't thinking there. So, so yeah. Uh, bad Antonov. <laughs> so, all the same, that was an amazing game. And that was only the Yak Tiger 88 left on the right flank. And he's obviously going to be taken out by some guy. So, that was a nice game. And let's see how we did. I'm really sorry, guys. But I forgot that it isn't possible to upload 8.8 .8 test server replay files to whatreplay.com. The replay uh, website that I use to show you the after game statistics so I'm really sorry but I can't show you that but I can reliably tell you that I got 
a bit above 143,000 credits and quite a bunch of experience of that game so it turned out pretty well and that ammo rack was just hilarious on that T34-3 uh, like we ammo racked him through the track so that was pretty nice and it was a nice game so I hope you enjoyed this as much as I did if you did consider giving it a like down below or even subbing to my channel I would appreciate it a lot and I hope I'll see you in one of my next videos bye bye